In the third video of this measurement series, we're going to talk about volume. So before we spoke about perimeter around an object, area is the space inside a two-dimensional or 2D object, and volume, as you can probably tell, as the best I can do with my drawing, this is a 3D object. So for volume, it's how much space a solid takes up. So the inside of a 3D shape. You would sometimes see this when dealing with the volume of um, a fish tank or filling up the fish tank. So it's all the space inside of this. So just like area, there is a formula for volume. And the formula for volume is length times width. And you might say to yourself, hey, that looks kind of familiar. And it does, because length times width is how you find the area of a 2D shape. But remember we said because it's 2D or two-dimensional, it has literally two dimensions, length and width. So because it's a 3D shape now, yes, we have two dimensions, length and width, sorry, length and width, but now another dimension has been added, and that is the height, how tall it is. So length times width would be just the area of that invisible rectangle at the bottom, but we want to know how much space is actually inside this 3D shape, so we have to add another step. Length times width times the height. So if we were to find the volume of this particular shape, all we'd have to do, the length, 5 centimeters, times the width, 3 centimeters, times the height, in this case, 4 centimeters. So the volume 5 times 3 times 4 is 60. And the way we write volume, we're still using the same unit of measurement, centimeters. But if you remember from area, it was just length times width. So because it was two dimensions, we put a little 2 up here. But you can probably take a guess as what the number would be for volume, because it's literally 1, 2, 3 dimensions. So it's a little 3. And how we read that is cubed. So 60 centimeters cubed or 60 cubic centimeters. Either way, that is volume because it's three dimensions, length times width times height. That's how you figure out volume.